Let's give everyone a live look now at Ocean City, where residents and tourists are being asked not to be out tonight as the conditions worsen and the wind and rain from Elsa intensifies. Eyewitness News reporter Alicia Roberts is along the boardwalk. And Alicia, please take us through how things have changed just over the last few hours. Well, certainly, Yuki, it started with the rain. The rain has really intensified as the night went on. It is raining at a pretty good clip. And within the last hour, the wind has also picked up. You can feel that we are starting to get into the thick of things here along the boardwalk. Take a look behind me. Most have heeded the warnings and gone inside. The few that are still out here using whatever buildings they can for cover. This storm has forced many businesses to board up early during the peak July. July 4th week, everyone here keeping a close eye on Elsa. You never really know what's going to happen. Gray skies and light rain had falling before dinner time Thursday, a sign of what was to come for Ocean City as Elsa made landfall in New Jersey. The water came up to about here. The Bale family watches for flooding after Sandy destroyed their previous house in 2012. There were just lines where the wall, where the water had been in every room downstairs. They say they'll be closely watching when this storm strikes. Depending on the tide, because if it's all coming in and it has nowhere to go, then it's going to sit for a while. Just down 8th Street, wind is the concern for the Sorensen family. We found some of our furniture three blocks up, seriously, yeah, up by the Acme. Last year, they learned their lesson. This time around, they're not taking any chances. So we tied everything down, one. all the floats out back, everything. Even as the rain picked up, boardwalk goers didn't seem deterred. We decided we would take our shot at getting on the rides. We're just having the best time. It doesn't even matter if it's raining a little bit. The landmen's vacation here every year and say they're taking the forecast in stride. If we have to be inside, it's a movie day. But um, I'm sure we'll get out for ice cream. We always do. And while this dance team got their ice cream in early, they're crossing their fingers. Elsa will go elsewhere sooner rather than later. Elsa, go away! And just to my right, you can hear the ocean. The rough surf is also a major concern here. Waves expected to crest six to nine feet. Ocean City Beach Patrol already have made more than 100 rescues since Sunday. They're warning everyone to stay out of the water until Elsa completely passes and to be extra careful this coming weekend after the storm. Reporting live in Ocean City, Alicia Roberts, CBS3 Eyewitness News. Alicia, thank you.